If any of you are parents, aunts, uncles, godparents, you'll understand the pain of your darling child coming home and asking you to explain the difference between a pronoun and an adverb. Don't even get me started on conjunctions and interjections. And that's coming from a writer. Hello, I'm Hilary and this is The Everyday Storyteller, a fun and inclusive show where I won't check your spellings or grammar. You might well be wondering what fancy words like analogy, metaphor and simile have to do with business storytelling. Well, my friend, they can add spice, creativity and clarity to your narratives, making your stories much more memorable and engaging. So let's get chatty about how and when to use these linguistic gems, it's easy for me to say, in your business storytelling adventures. First up, analogies. Imagine you're explaining a complex business concept to someone who's not familiar with what you do. That's where analogies come to the rescue. Analogies are like painting vivid pictures that help people understand unfamiliar ideas by comparing them to something more relatable. They establish connections and bridge gaps, making your story much more accessible. For example, launching a podcast is like riding a roller coaster. It makes you want to vomit with fear at times, but is worth the exhilarating journey. Nice analogy, huh? Next up, we've got the metaphor. Metaphors are powerful tools that infuse your business stories with symbolism, depth and wonderful imagery. They create a direct comparison between two things that are unrelated, highlighting shared characteristics. Metaphors are great for evoking emotions, sparking imagination and most importantly, leaving a lasting and memorable impression. For instance, Your coaching course is a lighthouse, guiding customers through the stormy sea of life, providing a beacon of trust and support. And finally, there's the simile. If you love making comparisons using like or as, then similes are going to be your go-to friends. Similes are similar to metaphors, but they use explicit comparison words to draw connections between two dissimilar things. Similes allow you to create vivid associations, highlight similarities and add colour to your business stories, making them more relatable and engaging. For example, her negotiation skills were as sharp as a double-edged sword, cutting through any obstacles in her path. They're also great for adding a touch of creativity and a bit of playfulness. Have a think about how you can use these tools in your next business story, social media post, reel or presentation to make your content more relatable, memorable and impactful. Just remember though, use them wisely and sparingly, ensuring they serve your purpose and enhance understanding rather than just getting in the way of your core message. Get creative, have some fun and let the magic of language transform your business stories. Happy storytelling. Thanks.